Hey what's up guys, today we're diving into some F123 action and we've got an exciting challenge ahead. The challenge is, we're going to head to head with the monster of F1, none other than Max Verstappen. I know guys that you all like this music, now let's switch the car to Haas. No, Haas made not the best on race day, but when it comes to qualifying, they're better than Mercedes. Can we beat the pole time of Max Verstappen and leave teams like another shitbox like Mercedes in the dust? And here we are in the best Formula 1 car in the world, and that is of course Haas made. No, we are going to beat Max Verstappen's pole position with the default F1 setup. Usually I don't use these camera settings, so I might be a bit rusty. And here we are on a flying lap. Breaking at the 100 meter marker. This section is so satisfying if you have a good setup, but now I cut the curb and my car went wide. My first lap was quite slow if I compare with Max Verstappen's pole position. My second lap was quite good until this happened. <laughs> After that crash, I was always gaining time. For example, this lap I did 1.28. I was always doing minor mistakes like this. Now I had to do hammer time, so I switched the camera I normally use. As you can see, I was so washed off that I couldn't even do trail braking properly. That was my best lap. I braked at the 100 meter marker. And as you can see, I had to good exit, sector 1, purple. And as you can see here, I use a different line, I didn't go white. Sector 2, green. And the last turn was crazy, I drifted like crazy mate. Look how much time I gained. And here's the fastest lap, 1.27. Guys, the time lap was close to Max's pole time, but the thing is, he is driving the 2024 car and I'm driving the 2023 car, therefore it's acceptable. I hope you enjoyed this video, this was my first video after making so many shorts on YouTube, so see you again.